So we're here at the Comunia book launch. Would you like to perhaps uh, tell us shortly uh, what Comunia is and uh, what it does? So Comunia is an uh, international association uh, under Belgian law, so we are very happy to be, um, to be here. And uh, Comunia is, about, is the international association on the public domain. So our mission is to protect and enhance and uh, make the public domain more, more accessible. So by, by public domain, we consider um, works which are not covered uh, by copyright anymore, but um, also open data, public sector information, um, scientific uh, research uh, results, and uh, works licensed under Creative Commons um, licenses. And Comunia Association um, takes over uh, recommendations uh, which were developed by uh, Comunia Thematic Network, which was a project uh, coordinated by my co-editor Juan Carlos de Martin. Thank you, Melanie. The um, Comunia was a thematic network with 50 members, uh, mostly from Europe, some of them from the US and Brazil. And uh, for three years and a half, we try to articulate uh, what is the public domain, why is it important in different parts of our life, uh, in culture, in science, uh, and uh, in uh, politics. And uh, after three years and a half, uh, we, man we try to summarize some of the main results uh, that uh, with uh, Melanie we curated uh, in this book that we are launching today. So that this is where we come from, and what we are looking forward is trying to keep, keep up the representation of uh, a dispersed general interest, uh, which is the public domain, which matters to everyone, but precisely because it matters to everyone and no one in specific is often not represented, uh, its voice, its importance is not articulated by anyone. And I think it's, it's maybe a good point to give the word to Anne and Catherine to explain what the Community Association will try to do. Thank you, Juan Carlos. Thank you, Melanie. Uh, when I was asked to join Comunia uh, one year ago to help for the creation of the association in Brussels, I think it was, and it's still, particularly inspiring and important because in Brussels there's a lack of organizations really working and advocating for a positive agenda uh, on IP. And um, there are some organizations lobbying and working with the institutions. But I think that Comunia has a very specific added value because it's, it's a group of experts, of academics, and also of organizations like Creative Commons and uh, Open Knowledge Foundation, for instance. And it really brings something particular um, on the debate on IP and on the public domain, which is particularly valuable in Brussels here because uh, everything is, well, lot of, lots of things are, are being done in Brussels. So we hope to be more and more active and to make the public domain expression something very crucial within and beyond the IP debate. So I'm very happy to be on board and I think we're going to have many, many things to say in the, in the upcoming months. Um. Well, the book is a product of the um, Comunia project, so actually all the authors were in a way or another involved in the project. And um, it's mostly academics, but we try to be as accessible as possible, particularly in the large essay by Giancarlo Frosio, which is the first major essay in the book, which tries to provide a background, trying to explain what is the public domain and uh, to give the, a mostly European foundation for the public domain, which is I have to say maybe the first time that something like that is accomplished, at least in this form, because uh, the discourse about the public domain started in the US and we have to give credit for that. But we really wanted to explain why the public domain is also a European concept and why it's important in the European context. And so you will find this sort of a 
um, foundational paper and then you will find more specific essays on specific subjects so I think that um, people can also pick and choose what they're interested maybe my, invita my personal invitation would be read uh, Giancarlo Frosio's paper and then pick whatever is more interesting for you and you can do that also because the book is available free online yes yeah, so you can uh, download uh, the book um, for free because um, it's under a Creative Commons uh, attribution license, so you can remix it, translate it, make uh, a movie out of comics. it, comics, uh, everything you want. You just have to to credit uh, the authors, and indeed, it's um, it's a mix of uh, theoretical contributions in um, legal science, in political science, also in uh, in economics, and also some essays which are um, describing projects which can be hopefully implemented uh, right away. So for instance we have a paper on, um, on drivers, um, the European project of a repository for open access scientific articles. We have also papers on science commons, on uh, the Open Knowledge um, Foundation which, um, which bring actual tools uh, so that the public domain can can be can be lively and we have also an article about uh, registries because uh, registration uh, would be a good solution both to be able to discover public domain works when they actually reach the public domain and also to um, avoid the problem of uh, orphan works which cannot, uh, which cannot be used. Would you like to add something on, on orphan works? Because actually Comunia Association is um, writing policy position papers and we published one um, last year on uh, on orphan works yeah, yeah. yeah that's right you can find it on the website and we published it when the Commission first issued the first draft and now that we're hearing that uh, there could be an agreement between the council and the Parliament on the legislation proposed by the Commission we think that the current version is not really bringing any positive more well further positive elements so we'll still have um, a lot of criticism to 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 bring to to the issue so we're going to 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 issue another 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 paper paper on that and uh, obviously it's a very very crucial issue often works so we are following the legislative uh, work of uh, in Europe very very closely if you would like to, to join us, to contribute uh, to a positive agenda on copyright uh, in, in order to enhance uh, the public domain, please go on the website, on the Comunia Association website, and uh, we're going to open up a membership to uh, individuals and um, institutions. Who, who want to, to contribute. So we hope uh, to, to have uh, more, more members and more, more voices in, uh, in Brussels and in, in Europe and, uh, and worldwide. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much.